Oh my god! Oh my god! The lights! The lights! The lights! Oh! oh no, the lights! Lights! Oh! oh. Praxis Prepper. So this morning, major grid down, SHTF event. I went down to my uh, basement office to check on a computer animation that I was exporting out of my computer. Uh, I do visual effects as my regular job. Um, and the lights didn't go on. SHTF. There's a windstorm. I, I presume like a limb or something knocked down a uh, you know power line or something to the street. Maybe it's just the street. Maybe it goes beyond that. I didn't actually bother to call the power company. I assume somebody else is doing it. Uh, it's a good thing about having neighbors who have like loud generators. You stick your head out the window and you can hear their generators on. You're kind of like, okay, they're home. I'm sure they know about it. Uh, they probably called it in. Um, yeah, so it's not a big deal for preppers. Um, the, uh, the computer process that I was doing it was on battery backup. Uh, I'm prepared. So when uh, when the power went out, I just uh, let it continue running on battery backup. When the batteries on that started getting a little low, I patched it into the inverter running into the solar panels, let it finish up that way, and I was able to finish up my work. Um, other plans I had for today is I w wanted to give River a haircut. It's kind of overdue for a haircut. Um, use a little buzzer tool for that. Um, didn't have to cancel that either. I just used a little, I've got a little Goal Zero uh, solar, uh, solar battery pack thing and just ran the little buzzer clippers off of that uh, and it was no big deal at all. Th this is what's great about prepping. It's, you know, there's been a lot of talk on my channel lately about like, you know, is it all about be people being terrified and afraid or just having a general uh, level of anxiety? Is that why people are doing all the prepping? But it's just more convenient. You know, uh, there's always bumps in the road and if you're prepared for them, then, you know, it doesn't cramp your style. You can just, uh, you can go about your day. You don't have to like change your plans or, all right. Not that changing your plans is a terrible thing, but you know, sometimes it's nice to be able to go, go through with your plans. Um, that's what prepping's about for me. You know, I enjoy it and I enjoy like the idea of being more self-sufficient. But it's, it's just convenient when stuff happens. Um, you don't have to run out to the grocery store, in, you know, in anticipation of something. You don't have to, you know, uh, you know, just fill in the blank. You can just uh, you can go about your day without without it being like a, a giant massive deal, you know. In your kitchen, you got paper towels. It's not because you're living in mortal fear that you may have a uh, you know a spill. <laughs> you may spill something. And you have this high level of anxiety, so you need to have paper towels in the kitchen. Um, gosh, people have fire extinguishers in the kitchen. And they're not going to bed like you know huddled in the fetal position. You know, worrying that they're going to have a fire in the kitchen. It's just, you know, it's what you do so that if something ever happens, it's not that big a deal. And today's evidence of that. It's a normal, laid-back day. The refrigerator's running on solar power. The wood stove's heating the house. It's a non-event. That's why I like prepping. Because it allows me to make all the choices about what I do with my day. I don't get pushed around by necessity or by emergencies, just do what I want to do. What are we doing? Washing cars? It's a beautiful day right, out, uh, right here in the greenhouse right now. It's not about fear. It's about just being ready for stuff so it's not a big deal when it happens. Eventually everything happens, right? <laughs> Maybe not in our lifetime, but uh, given a long enough time horizon, everything will happen. <laughs> And if it happens in your lifetime, if it happens today, if you're ready for it, then it's no big deal. That's it. Change Thanks it. for watching. No, no, lights, lights. Are... Oh. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video.